The Senate is meant to act as judge and jury, to hear a trial, not to rerun the entire fact-finding investigation because angry partisans rushed sloppily through it. The trajectory that the Democratic leader apparently wants to take us down, before he's even heard opening arguments, could set a nightmarish precedent for our institution. The fact that my colleague is already desperate to sign up the Senate for new fact-finding, which House Democrats themselves were too impatient to see through, well, that suggests something to me. It suggests that even Democrats who do not like this president are beginning to realize how dramatically insufficient the House's rushed process has been. I'd like to hear Leader McConnell come to the floor and give specific reasons why the four witnesses we've asked for shouldn't testify. I don't know what they'll say. They might have something, they're President Trump appointees. They might have something exculpatory to say about President Trump, or they might not. But they certainly were the four key people who saw exactly what was going on. What is Leader McConnell afraid of? What is President Trump afraid of? The truth? But the American people want the truth. A fair trial is one that allows senators to get all the relevant facts and adjudicate the case impartially. In the letter I sent to Leader McConnell, I proposed a very reasonable structure for a fair trial. I've sent that same letter to every one of my colleagues, Democrat and Republican. There is a grand tradition in America, speedy and fair trials. We want both. The leader seems obsessed with speedy and wants to throw fair out the window.